Hi there, my name's Stephen Wolfram, and I'd like to introduce you to Wolfram Alpha. It's a long-term project getting started. It's simple. You type your input, your question, and Wolfram Alpha gives you a result. Let's type in GDP France. Uh, you see the results come up, giving the GDP of France as a function of time. Okay, let's try asking the number of dogs on the planet. Uh, no result for that one. Maybe I'll try and rephrase it. So how about we phrase it like uh, population dogs for the number of dogs on the planet. Still no results for that one. But uh, let's think about something else then. Try a new question. See how this works for its attack. Let's try the number of sand grains in the Sahara Desert. Nothing comes up for that one either. Oh well, we'll still keep trying though. So, Shakespeare, pretty simple one. Yeah, there we see. Information on William Shakespeare comes up. Pretty important guy. So how about words in Shakespeare's complete works? No, no result for that one. Maybe that one's a little bit too tough. So let's try simply Shakespeare plays and see if the number of his plays comes up. No, no results for that one either. Oh, well. Uh, well, you know, Shakespeare came up. I'm a big fan of Chinese literature, so I think I'd like to type in Sao Chui Chin to see if any of his work. No, no, his works don't come up. How about another great Chinese writer, Lu Xun? Nothing on him either. Okay, let's try a different tack on this then. How about geography teachers in the UK? How many geography teachers are there in the UK? Uh, no answers for that one. Okay, let's see if Wolfram Alpha has a sense of humour then. How many Irishmen would it take to fit in a light bulb? No response to that. Okay. Uh, philosophical aspect then. How many Cretans are liars? No, no answer to that. Alright, well let's throw in a random one. How about uh, Oliver Reed and his liver? What can you tell us about Oliver Reed's liver? No, nothing from Wolfram Alpha there. Okay. Well, let's get back to something simple. See on the right-hand side, there's dates. So we have 18th of June, 2010. Wolfram Alpha computes this and tells us that this takes place in a year's time on 18th of June, 2009. So 365 days later. Wolfram Alpha has managed to compute that information. But let's see what will happen in 18th of June 210,632 no, that date doesn't come up Stuart Brand, inventor of the long now, let's see if his version of dates comes up no, nothing from all from Alpha there obviously it doesn't go too far into the future nor does it think about the now okay, well let's see if it can compute the number of seconds since creation no, nothing there. But then perhaps that's too religious a question. We don't know if there was a creation. So how about if we phrase it to Wolfram Alpha, seconds since the Big Bang? No, no answers there from Wolfram Alpha either. Okay, well, let's stick on science for a bit. See if Wolfram Alpha can compute whether hell is endothermic or exothermic. A classic question for chemists sitting there finals. No, no answer there. Okay, well let's keep thinking about science. See if uh, Wolfram Alpha can tell us how many neurons there might be in the human brain. No, no answers on that one. Let's see if uh, Wolfram Alpha has any opinions then on the question of science versus art. Nothing. Nothing comes up on that one either. Okay, uh, just as a matter of curiosity, see how the classical education goes. Ouroboros, the snake that eats its own tail. Let's see whether Wolfram Alpha has anything to say about that. No, nothing. Although he does have something to say about Eurobird. What is Eurobird? Let's have a look and see. Ah, oh, Eurobird is a spacecraft, and uh, impressively enough, is currently hovering over Africa. Okay, so, physics. Max Tegmark, important physicist of this day and age. Anything come up? No. Mistaken for Denmark. Okay, nothing on Tegmark. Well, let's try something else then. Let's see what Wolfram Alpha can really do. Uh, we can put in uh, France GDP, as we've seen. Let's put in France fish production. 
This gives us the fantastic information about fish production in France uh, as a function of time over the last 10 years. Very detailed uh, piece of data that we're given here. Let's put in another one. Let's see. Uh, Jamaica crab production. We have time to compute. Must be complex that one, but no, no information from Jamaica cab crab production. How about Iraq oil production? Yes, Wolfram Alpha computes this. It gives us plenty of information on Iraq oil production. Fantastic. But how about if we change this to Iraq WMD production? No, no results come up. Wolfram Alpha reports nothing on that. So, important comparisons that Wolfram Alpha can, can, can compute. Facebook versus MySpace, uh, as we'll see, uh, gives us a real-time comparison of the two daily page views, daily visitors. Let's check out a uh, comparison of other pages on the internet. Let's compare RedTube to YouPorn. No, no data on that one. Okay, uh, going back uh, perhaps a step, we were looking at uh, fish production in France. We've already seen this, but just to run it by you again, happily comes up. Well, let's show off exactly how good Wolfram Alpha is with foreign languages. Let's change this to Poisson Production France. No, nothing comes up. No other languages from Wolfram Alpha. No other languages yet.